Hey everybody and welcome to a new Will Wired accessory review. Today we're taking a look at an iPad mini case. This is the Dodo Case Elemental Series case. Uh, it kind of follows a tradition of mimicking a moleskin notebook style. Uh, there's a couple companies out there that are kind of popular for it, kind of being uh, the, the two other main ones being Portenzo and Pad and Quill. But this is by Dodo Case, in my opinion, probably the better of the three. Um, these guys specialize in making kind of your iPad look like it's in a moleskin leather bound type book or just a hard bound type book. Uh, they have two different kind of methods of displaying this. One is using an adhesive to keep the iPad to the case. The other one is a bamboo tray and this, that's kind of the version I got here. As you can see just by looking at it, it does look like a book. It's got the strap on the outside. You can kind of see the color right here of the bamboo and you can kind of see this nice hard bound looking material that's used to make it look like a book. Anyway, as you can see, you can you can kind of see the tray and you can see the cutouts right there. Everything's kind of shaved down. So you can see the cutouts for everything. Take this around here and a nice full cutout down there at the bottom. Um, this elastic band keeps the top shut. You pull it open like that and that kind of reveals the case. As you can see, we've got the bamboo tray right here and you kind of got the cool design here. This is all part of the Elemental series, as you can see right there, Dodo Case Elemental. They have a bunch of different colors, and uh, this is just kind of the black one. Uh, but it's kind of a, a new series they got going on with uh, some cool effects and designs going on in here. But they offer a huge freaking array of being able to customize this sort of case. So it's really, really cool. Um, anyway, let's go ahead, let's jump way ahead to the standing positions. Uh, when you're using this case, it's kind of weird. This is, let me move this out of the way, sorry. This is kind of the typing position, as you can see, you just fold it around the back. It's nothing crazy, it's, in fact, probably most would consider it not enough for typing. Um, it's very, very minimal. Uh, the standing position, actually, on this case isn't too bad at all. Uh, you simply stand it like that, stand it up vertically, like you would expect. Uh, if you're going to do it on a desk, it works just as well. And if you saw the little, let me pull this around here, there's a little plastic clip right here and uh, what you're gonna do is when you set it down like this on a movable on a desk that's probably slippery you take this little piece of plastic and kind of nudge it like that that way this part and this part stay exactly the same and it worked well I used this I've used this case at work the past three weeks and it's been fantastic I've had no trouble with the standing positions yes on the typing position it's not as optimal as I'd like so but you know you win some, you lose some, but no big deal. Most people probably wouldn't consider that a big problem. Anyway, moving on. Each of these four corners, sorry about that, is covered in a, it has, has a rubber just inlay. It's kind of weird, hard to explain. As you can see, it's just kind of like a rubber mark here. And these are where the corners of your iPad stick in and it holds them securely in place. Up here you've got the uh, camera hole, so that works great too. And up at the very top, we've got a little wood piece that actually acts as the power button. So when you push it, you can actually see it pushing down on the power button. And uh, it does not scratch the iPad or anything like that. The thing about this case is it's specifically designed with this tray, so it rests really well on these rubber hinges. So you're, it's not gonna mess up your iPad or anything like that, so no big deal. All right, let me go ahead and install my iPad here real quick. It's probably gonna turn my iPad on because I think I just turned my iPad off. You wanna go to the top first. And then you want to just push it down like that. Done deal. Good. I'm glad it didn't turn the iPad on. Uh, and it's as simple as that. These the rubber grip on these is so intense that you know it keeps the iPad in its place. Uh, as you can hear right here, you can hear it clicking the power button, and you can see I turned on my iPad. No big deal. So it, it works fantastic. This case is phenomenal. It looks great. It has a nice flair to it. And I think the overall purpose of this is, hey look, I'm not really carrying an iPad. Pretty cool, huh? This would be very handy for people who are going to airports, travelers, that sort of thing. It really disguises the iPad and makes it translucent to people outside of you, unless you're obviously using it like this. So, it really changes how the iPad looks. And as you can see, it's got the smart weight feature. So that works great. Um, overall, I really do like this case. It's really enjoyable. I like it. I've had some really interesting comments from people. Most people don't know what a moleskin notebook is, so a lot of people thought I was carrying a Bible. Kind of weird. 
So if you're looking at the other colors, they'll probably not get that vibe. So that was kind of funny to me, but no big deal. Anyway, I do really, really enjoy this case. My only worry with this case are the corners, right here and here, or the four corners. Um, a lot of companies, of the, of the companies that kind of do this case, have had trouble with this, and that being, if you're a person who takes your iPad in and out of this case a lot, it's gonna wear out those corners really quickly. So, kind of nervous about that. I'd, I'd, say, I'd probably stay away from this case if you're somebody who takes the iPad in and out of the case a lot. I'd avoid it. Otherwise, it's fantastic made, it's great quality, it's backed by an amazing company, and you can't really go wrong there. So either way, they do offer support. So if you do have trouble with the corners, boom, they send you a new one. I think they offer replaceable corners. I'm not entirely sure, I believe they do. Anyway, this is a great case. Uh, if I was to give it a ranking, I'd give it four out of five stars. I really like it. But the negative is they're a tad bit expensive. They can be, I think, 60 to 80 bucks. Kind of depends on the version you buy. So, But you're, you know, you kind of pay what you get for. Fantastic quality and a whole lot of customization. Anyway, thank you very much, everybody, for watching this review. This is the Dodo Case Elemental for the iPad Mini. And have a good one.